Hello all, welcome to CRS Info Solutions. In this session, we are going to cover about a uh, master detailed relationship. So master detailed relationship, it's a kind of special relationship where you can relate the parent and child like lookup. So, but there are certain different when you compare with lookup. So first point, so here the parent is actually a mandatory one so without parent you cannot create a child and second one here childs will not be having any owners so the owner of the parent will be the owner of the child and third one here if you delete the parent childs also will get deleted and fourth one you can take the count of parent i mean count of childs to the parent that is roll up summary is allowed over here so let's see how to create in detail so in last session we have talked about lookup so now what i will do is in address book we have employee lookup I'll just go and delete this object itself. Now it is removed. So now I'll try to create a new data type called master detail relationship. And I'll select next. And I'm relating to the same employee object. So here you are not able to create because there is a data type already exist with them. So let's see and just check it out. Is there any relationships already available for this? So let me test it on this. So we have only two records and, and Here we have removed it and we won't be having anything in the book. So let's try to create one another time. Let's select next. Let me check one another time. Okay, so here what I'm doing is I'll just go ahead and I'll just remove the record first. And I'll just try to create this one more time. Master detail, select next select employee so it got created so the reason of it's not getting created earlier because when you already have a records with parents and childs first you need to create lookup and you need to relate the parents and childs Later, you need to convert the lookup to master detail. Only that it is possible to create when you have existing records with object. So if you don't have any records, then it would be allowed without mapping it because in master detail, parent is mandatory. Without parent, you cannot create any child records. So now I'll create a new address. So test address one. So here you can find the employee field is mandatory. So I'll just map to employee one. So here, if you create test, if you create a new record, 
and this field will make it you as mandatory so here you can find the asterisk symbol and you can check it in the related of employee of one record so let navigates to record one and here you can see the test address one is populated so now what I'm trying to do is we'll cover about the point one by one so first point we have covered parent is actually mandatory and second point the owner field so if you see so here the owner is there but the owner is not present I'm trying to modify owners so here you can see this cannot be modified because when the owner is there for the parent the same owner would be there for the child and the third point cascading delete so before cascading delete we'll cover the fourth point first we'll try to create a roll-up summary in the next session but I just wanted to give a short um, information on roll-up so now here it's having address 1 address 2 and something so when you if you have a test address 1 test address 2 like this if you wanted to take the count over here that would be possible here so let's create a roll-up summary field and test it out To create a roll-up summary field, you need to go to Fields and Relationships, select New. Uh, okay, so it would be here. Select New. Mm -hmm. Let me check it out. Okay, now here you, you can see under employee this roll up summary is enabled select next and uh, here you can give count of addresses so here you have uh, four type of roll up type is there one is count and one is sum, one is minimum, one is max. So here we are going to do the count. So you can select the summarized object, should be the child object always. Select count, and you can select next. So it's done. So now when I go to the employee here, you can see I have related two records now if you wanted to create uh, relate one more record you can go ahead and relate over here so let me go to the details page and let me refresh it will just take little time and it will come soon okay so now after some time if you try to refresh the page here you can see the count of addresses two because it is related to records so what I'm trying to do is now I'm trying to cover the third point so if you try to remove this record I'll just check with the address books so now you can see this address book is empty so that is when you delete a parent record the child record will get auto deleted so this is how the master relationship will work and as well as this is how we can create a roll-up summary with master detail
thank you thanks for watching this video have a great day